Welcome to another edition of the Blazing Beard Bulls blog and happy MLK Day everybody. We know that this world has changed a great deal since MLK and it's also been a whole lot the same. So all I can do is say create more peace amongst your brothers and your sisters. More peace. More, more, more. I want more Etoine Moore. I'll tell you what. That's really, there's a lot of stuff going on today that I'll get to, but Etoine Moore is playing hard. He's playing great defense. I can count on him to make a three. He makes the driving runner in the lane, and he's confident. Keep him out there. He was doing great last year. He needed more minutes. Now he might have a chance to get more minutes. Please play him and develop him. We're going to need him for the playoffs. More, more, more. Powell is a beast. He's in the top five in double-doubles. He's my favorite guy in a long time, like Brad Miller. Just look, guys on our team that can stick an 18-foot jump shot, a 15-foot jump shot, and you just know it's going in. You just feel it's going in, and that's good because this team needs more shooters. Speaking of shooters, number three, Trey! Doug McBuckets gets involved. And one of these days, it'll really click for Doug. Right now, he's still kind of running around. But they're starting to get him the ball, and he's starting to feel it. And you can see some improvement, and that's what we need from him. Now, how you don't see Bobby Portis hardly at all in this game when Joe is out is beyond the blazing beard, brothers and sisters. That, that does a whole lot of Bs, brothers, and blazing, and beard, and Bobby, and missing. That's an M. He's missing. I have no idea. But hopefully we will see a lot more Bobby Portis. This is a Pistons team that is tough again. We don't have a guy like Drummond. I don't care if he's only 36% on the free throw line. He's a big body and a banger. And even that big lumberjack looking motherfucker, Bane. Bane. That guy is a big body too. And so you've got to have Portis out there eventually because the playoffs are going to get a lot more physical. So remember what the Blazing Beard said. Create more peace. Work for your freedoms. And we need more. We have a long way to go. Blazing Beard is in it with you and with this Bulls team. So a nice win after everybody's getting all sentimental and crazy and in their heads about the injury to Joe. So well done. And hey, Ron Jeremy's looking a little older. I mean, you know, not the porn star, but their coach who looks exactly like Ron Jeremy. Uh, even he's getting older, but he's a Van Gundy, and I guess I don't mind him so much. And technicals? I know I might be rambling now, but a lot of technicals thrown out finally. This year I noticed that they're letting the players express some, you know, ah, for a second, but, but, mm mm. Yeah, he needed to go, and uh, definitely they shot themselves in the foot with those. So, anyway, Blazing Beard, happy MLK Day. He's, he's one of the real heroes that deserves it.